How's it going YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, I like to talk about business, finance, and entrepreneurship. But in today's video, we're gonna be talking about real estate and some DUIs, DUIs, DUIs. Wait a minute. That you guys can do at home. So basically right now, I'm basically putting hardware floors in my own home and I wanna show you guys and tell you guys especially some of you guys that want to be flippers like myself and real estate investors i think this could be really useful especially when you're starting off because i know when i buy my first property i'm gonna have to be doing this by myself because i won't really be able to afford someone to do it for me and sorry if it's a little echo in here i'm gonna go to my room just shortly to talk about numbers how much it costs and how much value it could add to your home but without further ado, my name is Adrian. I own a five-figure clothing business. If you want to check it out, hit the links below. But anyways, let's get this video started. So as you've seen, me and my father are putting laminate floors in his house. And honestly, they're looking really beautiful. In a moment, I'm going to show you guys the final result and with the baseboards and everything it's just a massive upgrade unfortunately i don't have any videos that show the before but i do have the after and can i say like it's such a big improvement and it really adds value to the house how much well we're going to determine that towards later at the video but for right now i want to talk about the benefits and and how easy it is to install and how you can do it for the cheap so that way you don't have to be charged by another company to do it but right now i want to show you guys the after uh, disclaimer my living room is messy we're currently finishing up the hallway and we had to put all this stuff in the living room but here it is all right so here it is off my room the little dividers we did the whole hallway then my brother's room and then here is the living room sorry about all the mess like i said we're still trying to clean everything up but well, check out the floors and then here's the kitchen and then my dog, he's, he's asleep right now. But yeah, there it is. So now that you've seen it, you can agree that, that it looks really nice and it really makes the place sand out. And like I said, it really adds value to the home. Now, like I said, I did this with my dad and honestly, it was not that hard. Obviously, when you begin, this is something new. It's gonna be challenging and you gotta get used to it. But me and my dad, we, we adapt and overcame which really helped us. And if you do want to do it for yourself, I encourage everyone. Honestly, if you do it in your own home, it's going to give you a lot of practice if you do it in the future. For example, me, I really want to become a real estate agent and then go into real estate investing. So when I buy my first house, I'm obviously not going to be able to afford someone to do it for me. So I'm going to be the one doing all the renovations and everything to, you know, fix it up. So this is definitely not a bad way to start. And like I said, I suggest everyone doing it. You're going to need different types of tools for this measuring. But unfortunately, I'm not going to go over it. In this video if you do just you know search it up you don't really need that much the most expensive one I'd say is probably uh, a saw and uh, that's probably gonna be around 350 but you can always borrow it so let's get into the numbers and the business part so if you're doing this to renovate your property that you want to sell this is really good when it comes to ROI or return in investment as an entrepreneur would say two words entrepreneurship but I was reading and it turns out you can get a really good ROI when it comes to putting laminate floors in. We're talking somewhere from literally 90% to like 500%. And honestly, that's a really good return on investment, especially when you're renovating it. That's why you always see new renovated houses with that wooden floors because they're looking to get the most bang for the buck. So like I said, let's get into the numbers. My father paid around 3.5 thousand for all the baseboards, some of the tools, and the flooring of course some of the tools he already had uh the, the saw he actually borrowed from a friend and this took around a week keep in mind after work he comes home and then i help him do it for like three to four hours which honestly huge props to my father he's a really hard working man and he's just someone i really look up to so a week times let's just say five hours just to round it up so seven times five is 35 hours which is obviously a long time but in retrospective one week is really not that long of a time so yeah one week 3.5 
thousand dollars now he could have done it way faster and spent way more money if he would have caught up a business that would have done it for him probably like in two to three days probably have it done in one to two days and that would have cost him six thousand dollars plus the original investment of the wood flooring so that would have been a total of about nine point five thousand just to put all of this flooring in professionally now keep in mind me and my dad are fairly new to this and we're not professionals but i say we did a really good job and obviously it's not the best job but nonetheless it's really good and overall it's going to give him a really good look and return on his investment if he ever decides to sell his home now let's talk about how much value these floors have added to his house so i've done a lot of research like i've said you know you can get anywhere from 90 to 500 percent return on his house now we live in a small town in California where the market right now is really really hot the inventory for houses is actually really low that kind of bumps up the price a little bit but we're not talking about the overall house we're just talking about how much the floors actually gave us so honestly I am not an expert you know I'm just gonna give this a really ballpark estimate this added around ten to twenty thousand dollars in value to the house which is why it is one of the best house renovation hacks you can do especially if you do it by yourself he literally made ten thousand dollars in a week just by putting floors in now if that doesn't give you a reason to do it to your house or your next property that you're looking to sell then i don't know what is and if you are looking to put new floors for your house i suggest doing it it's going to be worth your time and investment and honestly it's not that hard especially if you grab a friend or grab your dad or anyone that you know is a hard worker i suggest going for it you know it's not going to hurt you in the long run it's only gonna bring you more money. But anyways, that's gonna be the end of the video. And guys, honestly, I've been feeling really motivated with these videos. I really wanna help you guys out and you know, I enjoy doing it. So if you guys could do me a favor, drop a like. If you guys did enjoy the content, subscribe if you really wanna keep up and you wanna learn more from me. I like to make a lot of videos about business, entrepreneurship, and my clothing brand. So definitely keep a lookout for those types of videos. But anyways, if you guys did or have or thinking about you know doing it, drop a comment down below. I'd love to hear it. And if you guys do decide to reply place the force i just want to say good luck but anyways i hope you guys did enjoy the video it's been adrian and i'm out peace guys